A very good morning everyone, you are here with another London session video. Today is the 27th of April 2022. The time of this recording is 13 minutes past 9 a.m. UK time. Before I start, as always, I would like to highlight that this is not financial advice. This is just the way that I see the markets and that I would like to share with all of you. Dollar, dollar index, dollar, dollar, dollar. Um, yeah, <laughs> I, I was expecting um, some pullback yesterday, especially seeing the divergence on an EU, AU, NU and GU. Yeah, um, but it did not really happen. Yeah, it did not really happen. What happened is, remember guys, those two black lines, this is our gap area on the daily. Yeah, and we just spiked through it. If we go now on a daily time frame, then we will see that we spiked above. Yeah, we spiked above, but then we could also see that we retested the lower end of the gap area and we are now trading higher. From a weekly perspective, from a weekly perspective, I think we have clear equal highs over here. Yeah, so this can be my target area. Um, also, if we consider this, let's say, as a low, yeah, this is our high. This is our, our higher low, really nice accumulation over here. This is a higher low, yeah, we failed to break lower. So if this is our higher low, then we can expect, of course, a higher high, yeah. So that, that's why I'm now expecting a dollar to run these highs. Going forward, if I go now to the one hour, if I go now to the one hour, um, then I see, I mean, I don't think we will uh, we, 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 there, there is a need to revisit this gap area. Yeah, I don't think, I think what, if we break down below so deeply back to the gap area and we break below the gap area, then we are bearish, okay? But for now, I would, I really do like, I think it's on the four hour. Yes, it's on the four hour. We do have a wake over here. We do have a wake over here. We have a very strong bullish candle. Um, so this is my imbalance area. Yeah, if you do not know what an imbalance is, please watch my videos in the Discord. Um, so this is my imbalance area. I would like to see maybe a reaction from here. Not sure if we will get there, to be honest. Uh, not sure if we will get there. If we do not get there, then I will be looking for this area over here. What we can see is that the market, yeah, opened here, closed here. And then the next candle opened here. Yeah, so this is a true gap. We have a true gap over here as well. So I would like to see a reaction um, in this area. Also, wick here, wick here, strong bullish candle in the middle. This is an imbalance zone. So I would like to see maybe price trading back into this area to then trade higher. If we fail, yeah, if we fail to hold this level, then I will be looking for this area. I think it's quite straightforward. We are bullish dollar. Uh, I was trying uh, to, to buy foreign currencies. Um, it did not play out well. Luckily, we could, um, yeah, we, we could, yeah, let's say get, get out break even. But uh, this is, of course, not really uh, the way that we would like to trade. So let's uh, just stick with the overall bias. We are bullish. Um, we should remain bullish. I don't see any reason why we are not going to grab the equal highs over here. So let's now be, uh, be patient. Let, let's wait for a pullback into this area, ideally into this area, and then we can trade higher again. So that means that we can see more bearishness on uh, GBP USD and Euro USD. Okay, guys, hope this was um, helpful. Um, I will update you eventually with a trade ID in the Discord. Have a good one. Bye-bye.